Hey guys, how's it going? And welcome back to another Monday Motivation. Today, I'm gonna take you on a bike ride with me. So without further ado, let me get on the bike and let's get going. All right, guys, so quick, quick little shameless plug. Um, I have a brand new travel channel in case you guys are not aware of yet. That's where I've been putting all of my Mexico content, all of my travel content, and so on and so forth, okay? So please, guys, if you miss or enjoy any of this uh, really cool content, you know, whether it's the, the brand new bike rides, whether it's visiting little pueblos, whether it's uh, going to the beach and all that good stuff, if you miss all that content, well then guess what? It's still around. I just have it on another channel. So please, if you want to check it out, it's uh, Jose Atiaga Travels. We got links at the bottom of every single video and all that other good stuff. So please check it out, okay? I'm also having a link at the end of this one. But let's get back to what you guys are here for. You guys are here for Monday Motivation. And what are we going to be talking about today? We're talking about being nice, being a good human, being a good person, and uh, why that's important to the whole um, concept of motivation. You know, at the end of the day, guys, you know, it basically, you know, comes down to the fact that, you know, all these things about manifesting the universe, manifesting all these good, awesome things, um, you know, um, all, all the things that I'm always constantly telling you about on this channel, like uh, for motivation purposes, you know, on how to create your, not just your universe, but how to create the world that you want to live in, how to create the life that you want to live, how to, how to do all that stuff. And basically how, what it boils down to is the fact that, you know, you gotta, you know, treat the world the way you want it to treat you. And that's basically it. If you are a good to your fellow man, then your fellow man will be good to you, okay? Now, I am, I try to be as nice a person and a good a person as humanly possible, but hey, shit happens. From time to time, I do bump into someone that's not a really good person. And it's up to you to use that, you know, black belt and niceness to combat that. Because that's the thing. You know, the reality is, you know, punch buggy, punch buggy. You know, the reality is, hey, let me show you the traffic, all right? You know, but the reality is, it's that it's a lot easier to be nice. I mean, I mean, sorry, sorry. It's a lot easier to be mean than it is to be nice. To be nice takes a lot of work, takes a lot of effort. And, uh, you know, most people are not willing to put in that work. You know, most people have a shitty day and they want to make somebody else's life shitty as well. All right, let's do this. That's what I like about being on a bike. I don't gotta follow all the laws. But anyways, but yeah, you know what I mean? It's, it's you create your own universe and that's the thing, you know? Like, if, if somebody, you know, does something bad or negative to me, I could very easily snap and, you know, really go crazy on them because, hey, look, man, I used to be a chef. I used to have anger issues. I was that guy, you know what I mean? I was that guy that used to go around fucking uh, spreading, uh, damn, I'm sure I was thinking in Spanish, but just, um, you know, very aggressive, very mean, you know, very hardcore, a lot of things like that. And basically, you know, it was, um, you know, because the way I saw it was that life wasn't fair to me. Life was shitty to me. Blah, blah, blah. The world sucks. You know, all of these things. And, um, and then I had to make everybody pay. And, um, you know, why should I be nice? You know, the only reason, you know, the only way to get ahead is to be mean. 
and you know all of these freaking things i'm sure a lot of you guys know what i'm talking about but you know the reality is is that it's the opposite it really is the nicer you are the the more kind that you are and all of these things like that the better things are going to come your way and that's just the reality of it as they say you are you reap what you sow and um and basically you're sowing seeds of despair of anger of negativity of uh you know the, the world hates me the world sucks you know blah 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 all these things then basically that's that's you know that's what you're creating that's what you're putting out there but if you do the complete opposite of that and if you're constantly you know uh being a good person pushing nice things um being kind to your fellow man you know helping an old lady cross the street you know helping somebody get something from a shelf um letting somebody get in front of you in line whatever it is all those things add up they really do they really do and that's the thing you know what i mean a lot of us you know don't see it that way and um, most of us are just creating a worse situation not just for us but for everybody and so you know that's the thing you know what i mean like unfortunately all right hold on let me see if we can do this sorry guys just trying to cross the street over here I'm trying to do a monday motivation video at the same time as uh i'm gonna run a few errands real quick but yeah i mean basically this is gonna be a short one i'm basically filming this like on friday afternoon i'm hurrying because i gotta go get something from the store me and christian are on our way to a wedding i've been dealing with many many clients i'm i'm planning my own wedding i got a million things to do the fact that i'm making this video is part of the motivation you know meaning i could very 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 easily not do a monday motivation and skip today's monday because again i have like a million excuses to actually do it but i'm even trying to put something together here to motivate me to motivate you to let you know that i'm out here every single day trying to do it knock it out no matter what you know just to let you guys know that you guys can also do it and knock it out and all that good stuff and um yeah so Alrighty guys, um, I'm here on my first errand. I'll talk to you guys later. Alright, I really, I, I, was, I was trying to do too much there. Coming up the stairs on this bike. Alright, I'll see you guys on the flip side. Alright guys, we're back. And so yeah, like I was saying guys, it's all about killing them with kindness. You know, putting out into the world what you want to come back to you and that's basically it but as i was also saying today's episode i'm trying to do like double triple duty as i always do here so today we're talking about the fact that i got a new channel you guys should check out so shameless plug don't forget the new channel so you can watch so many more videos like this of me going through all parts of the city already so many of you have missed out so please check out the new channel all right link is in the description link is at the bottom link is everywhere but anyways back to the monday motivation aspect to today's video which is what most of you guys are here for and um again guys kill them with kindness i don't know how many times i gotta repeat this but basically it's um it's really not that hard to um Really not that hard for you guys to figure out honestly and that's the thing you know if you guys can't figure out what it means to be nice all the time instead of being mean all the time then unfortunately you know um yeah i don't know what to say i mean i know because i've been there that's what we were talking about you know but basically my life didn't really start changing around my life didn't really start fucking doing that 380 360 you know moving in the direction i wanted it to 
until I started treating the world with kindness. It's not just about loving yourself and loving and just you, you, you. It's all about also loving your fellow man and being good to your fellow man and all that and everything that has to do with that. And basically, you know, basically, you know, the whole niceness thing, it's not really, um, you know, something that we do all the time anymore because unfortunately, you know, we a lot of us feel like life is constantly taking a dump on our head, but, you know, a lot of it has to do with how we react to these things and or not react, you know, it's, it's basically a lot of that. So, you know, again, I'm doing this Monday motivation. It's kind of like my mind is scrambled right now because I am at the uh, end of uh, a very, 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 very long week. I think I'm gonna go, man, anyways, I almost ran that guy over, see? Anyways, I was gonna go down another street. But anyways, it's been a long, exhausting week. I was about to throw this away, meaning I'm not even gonna make an episode today for this. I still have an upload. I gotta figure out, um, I still have a lot of work to do in between all the work that I already have on top of me. And right now, I'm talking to you guys, trying to film a Monday motivation. I actually filmed a Monday motivation earlier today. It, it did not work out because I had the camera strapped to my head and then when I looked back at the footage, I was looking at the sky, so that didn't work. Now this is a tent number two and now it's getting dark and I don't know if you're gonna be able to see it. I might have to, I might have to do a lot of uh, special effects so you guys can see it better. But look, see, look, there's uh, an individual right there in which, you know, could use help and could use your kindness and your love and things like that. Now you're probably thinking, oh, why don't you stop because, you know, uh, you're on your bike and you're talking about this, you could have just stopped and uh, helped that dude out. And the thing is, yeah, you're right, but unfortunately for him, I already helped out like a bunch of motherfuckers today and I know that guy and I help him out too with a couple bucks here and there. But the point is, is that you know this is just a motivational video so let's just stick to the motivational part and the fact is that is that you know right now i'm motivating myself to get this video done as soon as i get home i gotta put some of the things that i have on hold because i gotta figure out a record a video or i might have to do another type of recording for um the channel later on today for my regular channel and i gotta figure that out and that's the thing you know what i mean like you know, basically, sometimes, you know, I'm making these Monday motivations and, like, I don't have, like, a topic per se because I, myself, at this moment, am trying to motivate myself, trying to figure out, you know, what it is I'm going to do in order to satisfy my need to be able to upload every day to my channel. I mean, basically, you know, I have an addiction, and the addiction is video creation anyways but you know that's the thing you know right now I, I'm, in, I'm at the point in my life in which I'm always I, I'm always t hoping that you guys were would, would get to at one point which is to the point where you know right now I'm juggling a million things the one thing I should be doing basically here let me show you the traffic the one thing I should be doing all right this, this bucket but anyways the one thing I should be doing is actually taking a break and uh, getting to um, work on my wedding, getting to work on like so many million other things. Like I got clients, I have, you know, um, you know, just like a million, a million things, personal things that I need to be taken care of. But in between that, I, I still gotta do this and I don't wanna, you know, to me in my mind, it's like I don't, I don't really wanna put a stop to any of it unless I have to put a stop to it. And, um, you know, I'm not going to lie to you. Right now, I'm even having debates with my girlfriend because she's like, why are you doing this and that right now? Oh, I think that guy's going to go on it. Um, why are you doing this and that right now when you have already so many things on your plate? You know, you should be putting less things on your plate, not more things on my pla on your plate. And, um, and I agree with her. But, you know, the thing is that, you know, some people just don't understand the madman. And um, that's, again, the point I'm always trying to get a lot of you guys at where... You know, you guys just love what you do so much. You guys are so obsessed with what you do so much. You guys just know that what you're doing is the right thing in the bottom of your heart, no matter 
what everybody else says, even the people that love you the most, that you just do it no matter what. And so, you know, that's where I'm at now. You know, like I'm beyond obsessed, but I know that all this is paying off because it, it is paying off. That's why I, today's video is like about the kindness thing because by me doing the things that I do and being so kind and being just whatever, um, it has also, you know, brought a lot of individuals into my life a lot of you guys that are watching this right now um, that have been beyond crazy kind to me in so many ways that I can't even describe that is beyond humbling to me on a regular basis all right hold on I gotta park this bike let me park it over here and that's why I mean I'm baking this thing right now basically I'm not taking no one's parking spot anyways hold on hold on Sorry, I got a new get up here. There we go. Oh, oh, don't, don't fall, bike. All the things that I do. Okay, all right, we're good. But anyways, it's like I was saying. Bro, the whole fucking thing falls. But anyways, <laughs> but basically, as I was saying, guys, I want to get all of you guys to the point where you guys love what you do so much where you're just constantly fucking doing it. Even like again today, I strapped the fucking camera to my head. I, I did a video and it came out like crap. And um, in other points in my life, I would have been really pissed off today. I was just like, eh, shrugged it off. You know, I said, ah, fuck it. I got a few more errands to run. And I put the, you know, this, uh, the GoPro. Here, I'll show you. Okay, maybe I won't show you, but come on. Sorry, I put it on this thing here, okay? Oh no, what's going on here? Hold on, hold on. Sorry, sorry. I pushed the button, pushed the wrong button on the back of the thing here. Anyways, I'm still learning how to use this, but that's the point, guys, you know what I mean? It's like, I just don't stop, I don't give up, I don't quit. I don't wanna quit, I don't feel frustrated. If I feel frustrated, it's because I just wanna do it and, and things like that. And then, you know, even when it comes down to the Monday motivation thing, you know, today, I wasn't, I didn't have anything planned. All I, I didn't have everything, I'm beyond backed up, literally. I mean, no, no way, I'm not, I, I'm not constipated, I'm just backed up with work and shit. But, you know, the point I'm making is that, you know, I had to do the Monday motivation and um, I hadn't done it yet and it was already late in the week and I have a million things to do and it's like I gotta figure this out I gotta figure this out I gotta do this Monday motivation and uh, I didn't have a script and I have anything I have nothing ready I mean I never have a script but you know I got at least some idea of what I'm gonna do well, look I, I gotta get a haircut I just realized and I completely forgot to get a haircut today I'm gonna have to do that tomorrow morning now um, and, and there's just so many freaking things but the point I want to make I know I keep going in circles over and over again but you see how I just did? I just got the camera, strapped it to the bike, and I just did it. I Whatever that is, was. You know, I went and I did, you know, the, the Monday motivation, and now that's the end of the Monday motivation, and now I'm satisfied. I got to do a Monday motivation for you guys. You guys are satisfied because you got to watch a Monday motivation, and you weren't disappointed to wake up and not have a Monday motivation. So it's like, it's like a lot of this stuff is a lot of work but when you love what you do, like I love what I do, like I said, you have people like your loved ones that want you to do what you're doing. You know, again, my girlfriend wants me to do what I do, but she's even, even her, she's pulling me away. Hey, stop doing this. Hey, we gotta do this. Hey, we gotta do that. And it's totally fine, you know what I mean? Like I know that I'm, I am doing a little less and a little less. And again, I'm getting married this month. If all of a sudden this month, you're seeing a little less content from me, it's, you already know why. Um, but if you don't, you already know why too. And that's the thing. And I know a lot of you guys understand it and appreciate it. And a lot of you guys get encouraged by this and, and all that stuff. And like I was saying before, you know, that kindness always comes full circle. Okay. Whether it was that the other day when I got a flat tire and I had somebody out of the kindness of their heart help me out or other kindness that has been expressed to me by a lot of you guys and kindness, it just comes in many, many forms. Basically a lot of that came because, well, I've been treating the world with kindness and love for a very long time now. And um, back when the, I was treating the world like shit, well, the, the world was treating me like shit. But when I started treating the world amazing and loving, just like I love myself and all that good stuff, well, that's when everything just started coming full circle and becoming awesome again. So that's it, guys. I got to get going. I got to shower. I have a million things to do. I'm exhausted and I still have so much to do. Guys, thanks again for watching. Don't forget to please like, please subscribe, please share. If you like watching the point of view from the bike, please subscribe to the other channel. If you like all my Mexico travel videos, subscribe to the other channel. If you, live, if you love all this stuff, 
subscribe to this channel okay because again we got two channels we got all kinds of stuff coming at you all angles and uh yeah you already know what's up i'm not stopping anytime soon guys love you hope you guys have an amazing rest of your monday thanks again for watching and i'll see you guys manana on the other channel and i'll see you guys here on wednesday and then i'll see you guys later bye the quickest way to guarantee you'll get to wherever you want to get to is by treating every single person you interact with with serious love because they will build you. They will build you. They will put you on your back. And they're also the people that will fucking tear you down behind. You think, you know, you think somebody who's in power, in charge, who's got some juice, is the one that you need to be paring, pandering to? Those people aren't doing anything for you. It's the people that you're sitting next to right now. Kindness is gonna be the currency. And that is where we're going. And it's fucking beautiful. Like, it's real good. Like, everybody thinks shit's bad now. Let me just tell all of you what's happening in culture where we're spreading apart and we're like in an almost intellectual civil war and everything that's going on. Let me tell you what's going on. And remember that I said it. This is just one step backwards, two steps forward. We needed to get exposed because we were hiding under the makeup of the old media landscape. We needed to just come to grips that we still got some shit to get through. And now that it is on, like we're in it, the lights are on, our differences, the lights are on, our shortcomings, I'm happy. Because the way you go forward is acknowledging and respecting what the fuck is fucked up. And so I'm very optimistic. I think the next five to 10 years are gonna suck the way it feels like it's sucking now. I still don't think it's really sucking because you're in control. You can dwell on what you can't control or you can focus on what you can. And so I'm really excited. I'm really excited. I'm really grateful that you guys are spending 45 minutes of your time with everything that's going on downstairs here with me. So thank you and I appreciate you.